Well, hey guys, Alexander Gamer here, and I'm back with some epic you uh, for France. I don't know why I include epic in my intro there, uh, <laughs> spicing things up a little bit, I guess. But I don't know. Uh, right now, where this is pretty much gonna be, these next few episodes are gonna be pretty boring. Uh, I have to say now, simply because let's play. Look at that coalition. Now with these recent patches, coalitions only spawn up when they think they can take you. And well, I have, I count them before I came in, and I have five one province miners, two three province miners, a four province miner, uh, Great Britain, and Austria. Um, I should probably be improving relations with uh, Great Britain here. Mm hmm. Oh, yes. Yeah, we're rivals. Brandenburg? Brandenburg likes me. We're allied. No. I guess one we're allies. I have 8 out of 6 relations. Well, let's see here. My alliances are Trier, Savoy, and Brandenburg. Um, I have uh, Sicily, Sardinia, and... Uh, Neves. Those vassals. Yeah. So that's fun. Uh, my religious situation, if I remember correctly, is pretty poor. Yeah. My conversion, my plus 10% went away, and now I'm stuck with uh, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 11 reformed provinces. Now, it could be much worse. Uh, it's not that bad a ratio, and I'm also getting more provinces out here. Which is why it's going to be boring, because we can't expand effectively. And we have colonies. Making colonies grow. Um, I'm thinking of starting a second colony. Two colonies at once. I mean, like, I'm making 6.8 ducats a month. Oh, why? Because I have a 2, a National Unrest guy. Which is giving me none of that. Tab, this tab. Overextension. 150 admin power. Okay. Gain of stability. Okay. Uh, I'm looking for Diplo points right now. My current leader is at 332. Like, I'm getting uh, 8, 5. 5. Oh, they're both generals. Well, I'll just keep one general around, you know? Rebels Uprising? What? Oh, Catholic Zealots, okay. That's what makes sense. My colony, Miami. Uh, recall the diplomat, I don't really. Brittany? What? Brittany is colonizing. Interesting. Uh, like, I have a ton of force limit available for my army. As well as the fact that all these provinces are going to be granting me more naval force limit. Conversion is successful. Yeah. Cool. So I just banned my military fleet, which is not so good now, because I have no, I don't have the money to rebuild. What am I talking about? I have 14 carats. But the problem... Military armies, not armies, navies. Here we go. Uh, Britain has 74 ships. Granted, only 15 of them are heavies, and 27 of them are lights. I could build up enough ships, but Holland is a fast. Uh, I need diplo points right now. I need 360 of them to get this extra colonist. The permanent cost spell eye is meh. The naval force limit is okay. But I need this. I'm also way ahead on military points. So, military buildings, forts, and armories. <laughs> Don't have very many armories to build. I can build three over here in the new world. 
These cost how much? Uh, cause I don't know if I have any modifiers. 41 ducats, that's pretty good. Ugh. Oh. So it's an option, either have 19 rebels, or have 10 rebels. Well, we don't want, we have terrible, um, uh, we have terrible, I don't know why I can't speak right now, but we have terrible, uh, prestige, so we're not going to worry about that anyways. Bordeaux. Because I have this, don't they? Yeah. The Loire. Oh! That's embarrassing, I kind of missed. Missed the province I was aiming for. Nah, no biggie. That would be better if that went up, but it's no real big deal. Oh! There we go, we'll use our points to get a 4 2 2. Okay, that's not bad. Ooh, this is close. Close, close, close. Close, close, close. Alright, uh, without a leader, I'm probably gonna lose now. Yeah. No? They're gonna beat them up for me? Okay. I can handle that. Uh, who should I be improving relations with? Britain. Diplomacy relations. Improve relations. Because having healthy relations with Great Britain is always, always, always going to be useful for us. Because, I mean, like right now we're not going to be able to get across the channel. But they're focused on colonial stuff, so they likely won't attack us. Um, I'd like to get at Spain, but I have a feeling Spain has too many troops. Spain has 42k. 42,000 men. They also bring in Austria. And yeah, Aust that's why I don't do it, because they have Austria as our ally. And Austria has only 33,000. 12k manpower. Austria's not having the best of times. And they're at war with Brandenburg, Cleves, Brunswick, Commonwealth, and. Because I'm going to say, okay, this is going to be a tight fight between Brandenburg and Austria. Commonwealth. Not even close. Commonwealth has 65,000 men, and eno almost enough manpower to completely reinforce them. Not to mention Brandenburg has 18k men. Uh, you might be like, oh, that 18k is nothing. Well, they have 14 military tech. Their ideas, quality, and offensive. And let's look at the Prussian, or uh, their Prussian ideas. I'm pretty sure it's ideas. Prussian ideas. 7.5% uh, additional discipline. 20% uh, additional co infantry combat ability. 20% additional morale. It's just, army tradition is up. Plus quality. So three quality ideas. So they also have the offensive and the boost their leaders and manpower and stuff from offensive. As well as, that's quantity quality. They have 30% additional <laughs> infantry combat ability. Uh, more manpower recovery speed and 10% calf combat ability. I'm only slightly jealous. Oh, 8k rebels. Hanwit and noble rebel. Hanwit is a merchant republic? Uh, no, it's a kingdom. Okay, again, it's 20 or 10. Well, I don't know why anyone would ever select 10. Or 20, sorry. Why do anyone choose 10? Now, why would anyone choose 20? my question. This is mounts. Of course it is. Attached to my unit? Possibly? Guys? Hello? Anyone? No? Okay. That's too bad. Well, let's throw our guys at it anyways. We have more cannons. More infantry, better leader. Should be fine. Plenty of manpower if it doesn't work out anyways. Um... Let's just quick recruit a quick explorer to grab that. We'll recall this guy. Um, I can't believe we won that actually. 
Like, that's actually pretty surprising. But, I mean, we have tons of manpower, and we can only go up with our prestige. And they're losing that battle badly. Baden is not in a coalition against us. Um, Savoy is allied to us. Yes, we want to improve relations. Why is it so negative? Lots of things are ticking down. Probably neighboring heretic religion. Yep. Yeah. You, you're allied with Brandenburg in a coalition. That bring in the entire coalition, which I don't want to do. Lorraine here, Bohemia, Clives, and well. Uh, yeah, it's looking pretty bad. It looks like, oh, excuse me, a fair number more people would join in if I did anything more, so. Just expand the colonies. I mean, we're getting more force limit in the ships and army, which is good. Uh, we've discovered the Caribbean trade node. Um, and we have Panama trade node, yep. Yeah. And we have that this is what Mississippi River. Uh, mm. Amazon's Portugal. Portugal has a bit of quite a bit of cash. This is all Portuguese Brazil. Which is kinda weird. Oh, it's, it's all in the same colonial zone. Uh economic no, there's the um pretty sure there's a colonial zone. Colonial map mode? Uh no. No, uh, colonial regions, yeah. Colonial Brazil, colonial Colombia, Col Eastern America, yeah. Uh, da, 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 da. Send my colonists there. And now we're not gonna even worry about that leader. Yeah, that might be like, oh, you're so mean. Just getting rid of your leaders when you're done with them. The bloody hat. What the? What is my mission, anyways? Northeastern America. Northeastern America. Does this not count as That's Caribbean? I'll maybe like up here, colonial Eastern America. Okay. I just have to have one province here. Um. This is. Something. This is Colonial Eastern America, so I think that these are both are Colonial Eastern America. My autonomy is so crud. Because just the base is uh, overseas province. So. I came really late to this party, so I'm not getting the most choicest provinces. Base tax 1.2. Uh, I don't even know what that is. Base tax one. When my guy finally gets there. Um. Ships. Ooh, my voice just went there for a second. Um. Build some ships. Why not? We have money. We can afford it. Uh, do, 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 MR. I mean, now if I had, um, the, what is this, Diplo points? Ugh. Oh, I'll lose stability. I don't know. If it wasn't like 192. Uh, it's not telling me why. Uh, let's see why. Does it cost this much? The core before it changes culture. Okay. Well, no, I don't want to be down here. Why am I just teleporting down here all of a sudden? Uh, Flemish. Doesn't tell me Jack Diddley squat. Britain currently has the most part of the English Channel. Yeah, let's see this English Channel trade node. I have 9% here. I'm embargoing you, right? 
It might not be a good idea considering I'm trying to increase relations. Yeah, I'm embarking. Embar embarking them. That makes sense, but I really need these uh, free colonies. Sorry. Sorry, game. But yeah. Another colonist would be great. Definitely get me ahead of Brittany. Though they have 35. I have 55 a year. Can't beat that. <laughs> um. Whoa, that was slow. Probably because it's so. Yeah, it's because it's on such high speed. Um. At this point, I'm not doing it to uh, achieve. Oh, you have a new idea? Uh, tolerance of heretics plus three. We are six percent ahead of time. Bremen. More infantries to defend the cavalry. Uh, defend the cavalry. To defend the colonies. Okay. I mean, we have another diplomat. Who do we? Holy cow! Austria is losing bad. Let's just see my coalition. Can't be that bad anymore. Like, come on. guys think they're so cool. Religious rebels. There's just a giant war in the Empire tearing itself apart. Cool. I mean, taking more land would be... This would be a great time to take more land. The Empire... Emperor couldn't do anything about it. But, I mean, I just don't want to risk that kind of uh, AE that I'd gain by doing that. Still pretty bad. Ooh. Uh, attempt to search. So I lose ducats, which I have plenty of. Gain settler chance and gullible settler increase. Okay. That seems like a terrible thing to waste. Commonwealth is huge. Russia is huge. Uzbek and no guy are huge. Timurids are ginormous. Ottomans attack Austria more. Crimea's big, Spain is pretty big, but that's fairly normal. Hmm. I... I'm still trying to figure out why it gives you an offer to have a big revolt or a small... A big revolt or a smaller revolt. Like, it makes no sense to me. You can choose the size of revolt you want, and then go and crash it yourself. Uh, oh, Hanwit has left the military coalition against me. Excellent. Hanwit, where's Berkholstein? So all the one province miners are gone. Those guys would just generally be more annoying than anything else. And yay, I'm just gaining free army tradition, and I'm just uh, gaining power. Um, using up my uh, military, uh, my manpower, considering I wasn't using it. So I gain a stability or money. Don't really need that, but money can always be useful. Morale and navies. Nah, why not? I just need the points, is really what it is. Uh, jeez. That's kind of sad. So let's just see in the Bordeaux node. I have the most now. Spain is coming in here. It's doing nothing really. Brittany's doing fairly. Okay.
Uh, that was a lot of rebels. Not gonna lie. 10 stack, 12 stack, 45 stack. Okay. That's gonna be bad news. Uh, so this is when we just hire a new leader. And of course these 13k guys are kind of isolated up there. Uh, recall the diplomat. Let's see, Brandbert. Ask for military access. You wouldn't join. Care. What would it take to get you into the uh, empire? Offer vassalization. If I had more base taxes, too big. Akin. Akin hates me. Let's find the Protestant why they hate me. That's not Akin, that's Cologne. Was a Wargris expansion. Okay. Yeah, aggressive expansion is probably going to be a difficult thing to deal with. Baden. Modena. Modena. At least in peace. Aggressive expansion. Um. I don't know why not we can just sink a guy in there. See how it works out. Not going to cost us anything, you know? Using that new money we got, let's build some... Bigger... Batter. Let's build a march. I think 500 ducats. Uh, who are we gonna have a border with for, like, ever? Yeah. Well, it's not 500 ducats, only 411. Okay. I lost. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What did I lose? What? Oh. Um. That's just slightly weird. Why there was a rebellion out here, I could not tell you. End of the wars of religion in France. Gain 6 stability and 50 admin power. Too bad you can't have more than plus 3 stability. Oops. Kinda never told him not to go and, uh... Haha. <laughs> fight these guys. <laughs> but we're awesome, we're France. Um, Brandbert's coming to crush my rebels for me. I will come up here to the 36k stack. Infantry and cav cost. Okay. Yeah, we're having the religious wars out here, but that's fine. I like to get into these guys. Fast less them. Okay. Okay, now you'll head back to Korra. Um, Monster. There's some small nations somewhere. So. Nothing to be worried about. They didn't actually crush our rebels. Jeez. It's not very nice. You got, oh, and we're just destroying these guys, mobbing them. Our discipline is just 10% better than theirs. Their, their, mor their morale, though, is better. Even though we have Elon stuff. Uh, we now have 6k guys here. We'll take Randy Leader. 
Uh, force him up here. It's under 30k, 38k stack in there. Austria pieced out, but they lost land. Brandenburg! It's getting messed up. <laughs> it's at war with Britain, it seems. Uh, Colonel Great Britain, British, West Indies, Newfoundland, Burgundy. Ooh. That's no good. See the uh, coalition map? That's not the coalition. That is. What? How is that even possible to be the coalition map mode? Oh, of Brandenburg. Okay, yeah. There we go. <laughs> okay. Getting all of our trade goods to be produced. Uh, 20k stack in the Ile de France. You. Uh, no leader here. Good leader goes there. Needs to be reinforcements coming in there. Uh, and no, we don't want that tech yet. Bam. Battle one. That was a pretty dangerous yet simple revolt. Right? Uh, I'm paying a ton for reinforcements. So yeah, right now I need a ton of reinforcements. Um, so yeah, I see no point in continuing on for now. I'll just cut off here. Come back in in a little bit. Something either interesting happens or we go through enough time to warrant um, a new episode. That sounds good with you. And it's good with me. And we need more units because we have a ton of uh, open space. And we have four more ship slots. I need 20 ducats. Okay, see you guys next time. It's Alexander the Gamer.